Proper management of the economy has resulted in our ability to finance our flagship policies such as Free Senior High School, which is currently enrolling some 1.2 million pupils, the highest number of pupils in senior high school in our history. The program for planting for food and jobs, which has led to the revival of Ghanaian agriculture, bringing in its wake a bumper harvest in 2018 and ex exports of significant quantities of foodstuffs to our neighbors, with the same expected for 2019. One District, One Factor Initiative, which is ensuring an even spatial spread of industries in the country. The village, One Village, One Dam policy, which is guaranteeing all-round agriculture. The restoration of allowances of nursing and teacher trainees that were scraped by the previous government. The employment of 100,000 graduates under the National Builders Corps, the Nation Builders Corps, and the recruitment of 60,000 young men and women under the Youth in Afforestation Program. The National Health Insurance Scheme has also been brought to life back to life through the clearing of the 1.2 billion legacy debt of the past government. My government continues to demonstrate its commitment and determination to ensuring that the habits and sins of past managers of our public finances are no longer visited on this or future generations. 